the final event of National Haiku Poetry Day for 2013 was celebrated in Washington, D.C. at the Japan America Society. The meeting, hosted by Topath Haiku Society, featured readings by members of the Society as well as an open microphone. Readers included seasoned veterans, swaggering downstream drunk on last year's ice, April River, as well as those making their first attempts. Hi, I'm Herb Guggenheim. I'm a poet, not a haiku writer. So I, I wrote these um, before I really knew um, what constitutes a haiku or a sinru. So you'll have to bear with me. Often with surprising results. The magnificence of the cosmos is starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> there were haiku. Through plantation blinds, broken English. Senryu. Recycling center. They seem like people I know. Even the occasional haibun. Growing up in New York City, I would spend hours at my best friend Caroline's apartment. Her father taught English, and poetry and art books filled every space. On a crowded bookcase lived a modest set of small haiku books. My old father, too, Look long on these white mountains through lonely winters. Isa. A few years ago, Caroline gave me her father's haiku books. My favorite is titled Cherry Blossoms. Whenever I open it, I am back in Caroline's living room and her father, the first to die, is alive and well. Winter dusk, when dad would phone. They were read straight up. Swimming lesson, my son floating away from me. Occasionally accompanied. Breaking open the pomegranate, the taste of red. And always in good humor. New catalog, I order Narcissus Poeticus just for the name. <laughs> the meeting also featured the announcement of the 2013 Haiku Now contest winners and the winners of the 2012 Touchstone Distinguished Books and Individual Poem Awards. This event concluded the 2013 National Haiku Poetry Day celebration held from April 13th through the 30th during National Poetry Month. National Haiku Poetry Day is an initiative of the Haiku Foundation.